welcome back to my channel it's great to see you guys again in another video in today's video today we are doing a tarot reading for cancer in november of 2021 thank you guys so much for watching subscribing to the channel and liking these videos um and comment down below to connect with other cancers as well in your um moon rising or sun sign all right i'm just going to go ahead and get into the reading um read the vision down below pause the video and read the vision down below that way you guys can go ahead and look at what's going on in my head right now and trust me everything is going to be connected i know some people are like what is your vision talking about well it's going to be explained in the tarot reading okay so i just want you guys to definitely get that vision okay also today i just wanted to let you guys know that the yellow chakra is lit today and that's the main candle for the month of november also with citrine sorry yeah citrine um just a little bit of citrine that i do have but it is also the november birthstone as well and it's bringing positivity love and light with you guys so i just want to bring that on for you guys today and yeah let's just go ahead and get into the tarot readings it's funny that i was just thinking of the four of cups not long ago but i'm just going ahead to shuffle the deck but i'm also going to talk about the reading as well and the vision that i had also just to let you guys know if you guys do like these videos please like share and subscribe to the channel thank you very much those are free ways you can do it but if you feel like donating anything all my payment information down there is down there and if you'd like to book a reading with me too feel free to contact me i definitely have that information set up for you guys that way you can contact a private reading from with me all right i think i covered everything free donation all yes so pause and write um read the vision if you did and then yeah come back <laughs> sorry i'm just thinking of everything i wanted to say making sure that i have everything together but cancers we do have a special reading for you guys today and i hopefully i will be able to be on camera soon and show you guys the new setup since i'm transitioning into this new space okay so cancers you guys are the mothers of the zodiac signs i just want to let you guys know that so you guys are automatically very 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 protective of your young and that's what i saw today today your totem was actually the crocodile um and also too you guys were in an action movie in my head so my vision started starts off with you being an action movie um protecting your young um protecting what's inside of you i did see some pregnancy some maternity some abundance coming through so I just wanted to guys, let you guys know that that was part of the theme there since you guys are the mothers of the zodiac sign. So you automatically bring abundance to yourselves and you're also very caring and nurturing. So a lot, I don't see a lot of people, but I did see a lot of pregnancy energy. I saw a lot of abundance. So if you guys are looking to be pregnant or anything like that, November looks like a good time. But um, because we're about to get into the fall season, that means more cuddles and stuff like that, you know. But if you're not looking for that, it could be abundance of certain things. Like it could be protection of your energy protection of your time but i did see protection of family a protection of ch children as well and your duties that you feel like you have to be like you guys felt like a superhero in a way all right i'm gonna stop talking i'm gonna go right to the de deck and shuffle
All right, guys. So I just wanted to quickly meditate real quick and make sure that I'm getting everything in the reading. So let's see what's going on here. So automatically, you guys, I see that you guys are being very blessed in November. This November energy is giving cancers very much blessings. You guys are going to be very, very, very blessed. Let me just say that. So like I said, in my vision before, um, if you read the vision down there, I did feel like you guys were the action hero in the movie. You guys were blessed with many gifts and your gifts were to give to other people as well. So you guys are literally um, being heroes to a lot of people. And I see you being heroes to your young, to your family. I don't know what you're protecting. If you don't have kids, it could be something that you're protecting over nieces or nephews. It could be, I saw younger people, which I did get the Six of Cups already, but I'm just gonna go over everything to make sure that you guys got that energy. Um, like I said, cancers, your protectors, your mothers, your providers, feminine energy, divine feminine energy is coming through. No, sometimes we fail to realize that most of society's superheroes can be female as well. So that's why I say both divine feminine energy, but it can also be masculine energy well for the you, man, you uh, male cancers as well. If you guys, um, you know, talk about that as well. Um, let's see here. So like I said, you're you are getting back up. Um, I got this three of swords coming through. So three of swords in reverse. I love the three of swords in reverse because there's no way, there's no way to go but up. You guys are healing yourselves. You're healing your heart. You're healing your soul. Like cancers are very emotional and it's hard because, you know, it's hard for you guys. But I think about cancers as though um, you guys can get hurt over and over again. But like I said, your mother. So the hurt doesn't really, um, it does affect you because we're all human. Mm -hmm. sorry we it, the hurt does um affect us because we are all human but at the same time you guys have that mother protective energy like you can take over anything because you know kids say hurtful stuff all the time and mothers you know that love outshines the actual the pain that's why a lot of cancers do take a lot of pain um sometimes when it comes in relationships um it could be working out all that other stuff as well. You guys do take a lot of crap, but guess what? Your heart is being healed because that's what you guys do. And you could be a healer too. Um, you could be someone who someone talks to or someone who provides for. So that's why I saw a lot of protection. I saw a lot of abundance. I'm surprised I didn't get the Empress, um, but I did see a lot of um, energy coming through with mothering and like, you know, just abundance. So I did see pregnancy coming through if some of you guys were that, but I did get the Wheel of Fortune. And the reason why all that, all your blessings are, are coming to you, Wheel of Fortune is great. You guys got luck coming through. I can already see in your change card as well. You guys have luck coming through. You have abundance coming through. I see that pregnant energy. You guys are fighting the good fight. Um, the totem is a crocodile or a gator. Um, many people know this, but crocodiles and gators, they're very protective of their young. I rarely hear them eating their young, but they're very protective of their young, their hatchings and stuff like that. And of course, they're the ones who give like, you know, protection towards their young, especially until they get to a certain age. And then that's when they let them go. You, on the other hand, guys, you're still protecting your young. You're still being there for them. You're still caring for them. I got that energy as well. So let me go up to the goals. Your goals is to provide. Um, one of the biggest things for cancers to do is to give. You guys love to give, nurture, and provide. That's why you guys consider the mothers. You guys very give. And especially if you want it your way. <laughs> but at the same time, um, like I said, you're learning the balance of giving and taking. Sometimes cancers give too much energy, too much time, and stuff and like that. And that's why you see a lot of cancers who need to relax, recoup, and re regenerate because they're giving so so very much so be careful of that energy guys um at the end of the day you can't give to from a glass that's empty but like i said financially six of uh, pinnacles financially is coming through so you guys do have enough abundance you guys are being blessed with abundance to give to other people as long as you don't give too much i love that it's upright because you're determining which abundance you want to give um and it's helping out a lot of people as well. So that is your goal. That is your goal, Cancers. You want to be able to give, provide for a lot of people, especially your families, your loved ones, your kids. Um, Eight of Pentacles came through. This is a happy reading, you guys, especially for Cancers. You guys, you have worked very hard and the universe have sh has shown it. I don't know which, I don't know if you're winning the lottery. I don't know. Like, you know, don't quote me. I don't know if you're winning the lottery. You're winning some amount of money or something like that. Because it seems from the deck because you're breaking and releasing. But at the same time, like I said, you had that hero complex where you're ready to save people. Because you've been working hard. 
Um, Eight of Pentacles is giving me working hard energy. So maybe you had some time alone. This year, you have been working at your best and practicing your craft as well. You've been able to practice your craft, Cancers, and do it well as well. Um, Six of Cups came through. I think you guys... You guys always give because you guys wish that there was someone there to give to you. I'm getting that vibe. I'm getting that feeling. Um, some of you guys probably grew up. That's why the six, the three of swords is um, also in reverse too. You guys probably were hurt when you were younger, but now that you're grown and now that you're able to give back and provide for the community, it could be community kids. Um, usually people get worried because six of cups also means twins. I don't know, twin energy as well, <laughs> especially if you're pregnant. Um I always get that energy. I remember, I'll never forget reading about the Six of Cups and talking about twin energy. So if you guys are pregnant and that does come abundant to you, to you guys. But at the same time, like I said, it's a big energy next month for like, you know, things to happen like that. Um, um, overall cards that I did get from the top and the bottom was threes. Um, but they were both in reverse. So overall energy, you guys are doing some solo work. Um, the thing about a hero in any action movie, they usually work alone. It's only recently since we've seen a lot of Marvel movies and things like that, that many heroes are coming together. But each of them have their own story. So I do see you guys being a hero, but sometimes you have to work alone. Sometimes you feel like you have to work alone. That's normal. Um, but also to be careful who you're giving out your energy to. Um, Three Cups in Reverse is not giving the good goodness of friends. It's, it's water signaling water signs and stuff like that but this is earth signs as well water and earth energy they go together very well so um you guys be careful who you're giving your energy to be careful who you give your blessings and abundance to because not everyone deserves it i know it's hard for you cancers to decide because it's always hard for you to do that but at the same time be careful of that energy okay all right so next we have the devil coming through, but it's coming in reverse. So guess what? You guys are releasing your chains, breaking your chains away. I think financially you guys are breaking away because there's so much abundance being given here as well. But at the same time, you guys are breaking your chains away from certain people in past relationships. That's why I said the three of cups also came through. It could be a job. It could be friend, family, friends, relationships too. It's hard for, for cancers to walk away because you're so emotional. Water signs are emotional and loyal it very much so you are um but you guys usually stay longer than you're supposed to so if that's ringing the bell to anybody make sure that you are breaking the change with somebody because their blessings are blocked usually by the people that you hang out with and hopefully you can ask the universe not to do that for you and be like please give me my blessings i want to leave <laughs> but at the same time um sometimes it also depends on our mind as well because when our mind is blocked someone can still be there but if your mind is blocked that's a big thing because like the devil is like about manipul manipulation capricorn energy manipulation um things like that okay all right so next i got the page of swords in reverse make sure you know where you're going with this new direction of a new abundance coming through if you guys want to um just know your plan i would say plan it out because pages of swords in reverse is no plan no energy gone with the wind you're doing it in a certain way but that's a messenger as well make sure you're getting all your messages right make sure contracts and um good contracts, good reading about the abundance, about people's energies. Make sure you're not just blindly going through it. This is a mental card right here, but it's also about getting good mental messages and deciding what you want to do. Um, let's see here. Um, inner emotions, eight of cups, you're ready to move on. You're ready to give that nurturing side to a lot of people as well. Um, but it also could be a relationship thing or a work thing or something like that. Once you get the abundance, you have to move. It's time to move. And maybe it's because of the person that who has hurt you. Like I said, cancers stay usually longer than they're supposed to. That's because you guys love. And you love hard as well. Overall, any card that was reversed, I have to keep mentioning that. Any card that's reversed can and will can be upright any at any time. So be careful and be warnful of that. But I want to see this Ten of Cups overall in your next month to be upright. But right now, make sure that all the abundance you're going to is protected because you could be making money with the wrong person or it could be an overall success. Are you really saving the person? Are you saving them for good? Or are you always going to sit there and protect them? Like I said, you guys have protective energy, action hero energy. You guys were the hero. Big hero energy, big protection energy. I did see abundance pregnancy as well, but you're protecting people. But the thing is, you guys were protecting 
young that hasn't made it to this earth yet. So I did see you guys pregnant or like, you know, in the vision, but at the same time, you're protecting that young, but at the same time you're wearing, it's a heavy weight on you guys. You guys, it was hard for you guys to move anything. It was hard for you guys to move. Um, it was hard for you guys to move any, any of that energy. Like it was hard for you guys to move rocks and stones. Like mothers have the weight on the world because of their kids. So and pregnancy, and people don't really like to talk about this a lot, but pregnancy is very um, hard on the body. So I'm getting that message to take care of your body and your strength, do some weight training and stuff like that to strengthen you because that's very important too. And also protection is coming through. I don't know if you guys have realized, but a lot of things have been going on with safety and people get yourself become safe. Um, be careful who you hang around with. Be careful who you're around because they don't always have your back. And that's why I said the 10 of... Um, pinnacles came through in reverse so don't break bread with the wrong people cancer that's one of your things that could happen or you may be not satisfied but i didn't see that much in the readings though but um, i think you need to walk away emotionally from something but you also need to know what you want it want to and because i got the page of swords in reverse and then three of pinnacles and three of cups the people that you're around may not be the right people to be around yeah I don't know why he's working. Anyway, so that's the reading. Uh, let's see here. What else we got? Overall, I love this change card because I was looking for this change card. That's why I mean that there's going to be some good money coming for you guys, Cancer. You guys got the windfall card for um, your change for the month of November. So that means you guys are getting money um abundance is coming through um like i said if you guys did not want to be pregnant or don't plan on being pregnant okay so if you guys didn't plan on being pregnant um also too you did guys didn't plan on anything like that or you already have your kids or anything like that don't worry about what i'm saying but this is for people who are wishing to or you know want to but at the same time like i said i did see pregnant and abundant energy think it like this when i say abundant fertility energy it could be for anything a business a relationship abundance means multiple things growing like flowers or growth so I did see the windfall card coming up. Great abundance, great amount of money is coming through. It could be through inheritance, inheritance, or sorry, um, inheritance. If that's <laughs> I'm trying to say the word right. Um, it could be through lottery winnings. It could be through just something to like you know out of nowhere. Money usually windfall is like money out of nowhere, or it could be a bonus at work. It could be something that you already are planning, and yeah. So that means good surprises are coming through, debt may be paid off, things like that. But it's also too able to, but I see that you guys are ultimately giving. So that's one of the things I wanted to talk about. Okay, I'm about to go over the cards real quick. And yeah, just a quick overview. All right. So overall, um, cancers, you guys are definitely, definitely healing through something, growing through something. Like I said, no one was there for you when you were growing up, but that cancer energy basically made you who you were and said, I want to be there for people because I know how it feels. I'm just getting that energy as well. Um, cancers usually tend to have a parent or something like that who wasn't the best parent and even if you did have the best parent as well there was something always missing because it's hard to please a cancer <laughs> but at the same time you guys want something better for your kids i see you guys protecting providing especially for young that's not already here so if you guys are pregnant or anything like that i did get that um reading the message um but at the same time like i did see like abundant energy like i said you guys are the mo mothers of the zodiac sign the wheel of fortune already came up so luck is on your side in november if you guys want to apply for anything or to go out and reach for anything abundance is coming for you luck is good for you as well that means good opening cycles it also could be a cycle that is ending and beginning so it's a new cycle could be a new cycle of wealth new cycle of education new cycle of love as well but I, that's what mostly that i'm getting i'm getting abundance i'm getting a hero action energy you guys are going to be the heroes of um november 2021 and that's important for you guys to understand that so you guys will be able to provide you guys have a duty on this planet and the goals here is you already know it 
you you're able to give and provide like i said cancers are very much givers but you guys tend to stay and give to the wrong people so six of pentacles is giving up upright that is your goal but i did see the three of cups and I did see the three of pentacles in reverse. Guys, don't give to the wrong people. Don't be loyal to the wrong people. Cancers stay longer than they're supposed to. And even though that past the trauma of kids and stuff like that and your childhood as well is coming up, please don't give to the wrong people, okay? Because they tend to take more than they actually um, will give back. Um, like I said, you guys have been working hard. Cancers are hard workers. You guys will work really hard. That's why you guys are automatically abundant um, in November and also too. Twin energy is coming through. <laughs> Twin energy is coming through. Six of Cups is coming through. So I don't know if you guys are manifesting that if you are pregnant or if you're wanting that or something like that. But I do see abundant of kids coming through. And like I said, protection is coming through. I love the Six of Cups because the Six of Cups, the older child or the older woman is giving the kids something. So you guys are giving emotion protection. Like I said, this is the protection that you're giving. That's why you're very protective when you're young, your kids or anything that you control. Business aspect, it could be family, niece or nephew, could be the rich auntie or uncle <laughs> but also too you're remembering as a kid how it was when you were growing up and you don't want to you're breaking generational curses you're breaking generational you know things that happen in your childhood and that's what you want to happen okay um overall your question is will whatever question you have whatever question you have this is the answer the devil's coming up capricorn energy is coming up you guys are released you guys are free. That's why I saw the crocodile energy. You know, crocodiles, they roam how they want. But at the same time, um, they're also protective of their energy. And there's, you're set free. You're set free, Cancer, to do what you want and to not be manipulated. I see you guys do breaking free from that energy. That's important, too. But, um, okay. Also, too, like I said, the messages that you're getting, be careful because it's up in the wind. Do you know exactly what you want to do? Do you know who you want to give your time and energy for? Just think before you give out. I have to say that because like you guys saying, it's a wealth of abundance. It's a good energy coming through. But at the same time, do you know who you want to give to? And make sure you don't give too much to where you become broke or empty or not a cup full, okay? Eight of Cups is walking away from something. I do see you guys walking away from something. I do see a relationship walking away, though. I don't see anything really financial or anything like that. Like I said, but at the same time, you need to know who you give your energy to. If you're the only one who is working, the only one who is being social and reaching out to people, take that as a note. Take that as a note because you are the only one. Like I said, Three of Pentacles. This is solo energy solo energy you guys are the heroes heroes have their own films heroes have their own movies they're the ones who have the power to help other people only time you see a collaboration is usually marvels and stuff like that but that's a collaboration on everyone has their superpower cancer what is yours and you have to leave those people around leave those people behind who are not giving what they're supposed to give okay i know it's hard for you guys because cancer stay longer than they're supposed to like i keep saying Overall, you got the Ten of Pentacles in reverse, but at the same time, I think this could be upright for you guys once you guys start working on it. Like I said, you're breaking bread with the wrong people. Ten is about completion. Nothing is completed yet. You still, you still got work to do. There's still a long way to go, but like I said, this is breaking a cycle. So that's where I see you guys in November. You're breaking a cycle. It's important to, it's important to learn that lesson. It's important to know that energy as well. So just know that that is important okay overall you guys had a good reading i love it i hope you guys love it too this is good energy this is great energy abundance like i said pregnancy energy abundance like it's just giving you know protective energy but most of all it's about protection protecting of your family protect of yourself i want you guys to protect yourself too don't just worry about the people as well protect yourself and your energy too we want you around too cancers all right well thank you guys for watching i enjoyed this reading so much like I said, please like and share and subscribe if you want something um, to do something free for me. Thank you very much. Um, and even if you're donating, the links are down there for you to donate. Um, I appreciate every donation. I don't care if it's a dollar. But even if it's a free donation, please like and share, subscribe. But the donations do help with these readings. All right, you guys. Thank you guys very much for the message. I hope you guys enjoy this message. And I will see you guys next time. Okay. Cancers, you got this. You guys are superheroes next month. I love all the energy, okay? All right, bye-bye.